afternoon, and we are losing a little steam in the afternoon. While well, major companies like Chessie and Morgan Stanley did beat earnings, the market sentiment is basically flat. However, I'd like to mention that those stocks are still up today. Sometimes after a big move up like we had yesterday, the markets take a pause. Also, what just broke is CIA Director Mark Mike Pompeo did visit secretly last week North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. While President Trump said that the meeting went very smooth, market participants could be unsure of what's next, what is up America's sleeve, or what's going on that we don't know in the meantime. Uh, the dollar joins equities. It's pretty flat on the day. A uh, euro dollar is up 0.13% at 123.86. Sterling is down 0.38% at 142.34. Uh, the dollar yen is up 0.14% at 107.16. And we're going to take a look at the Swiss franc because, hey, that's a neutral currency, right? The pair stands above its strong horizontal support at 0.9635 and remains supported by its rising 50 period moving average. Long positions above 0.9635 are favored, with targets at 0.9695 and 0.9715 in extension. Bitcoin is down a little bit, 0.42% at 8,094. The upside prevails for gold that has broken above a declining trend line and remains supported by its rising moving averages. Long positions above 1,341 are favored, with targets at 1,358 and 1,365. Silver is booming today up 2% at 1710 a troy ounce. Follow Trading Central on Twitter for all of your Forex market updates and for Trading Central Web TV from the New York Stock Exchange. I'm Olivia Vosnenko.